Welcome to my channel Swiftlearn. In this tutorial, I will show you how to change grid view raw color on mouse over or how to change uh, grid view cell color on mouse over in BB.net on palm application. If you don't subscribe my channel yet, please subscribe and press the bell icon for upcoming videos. This is my server catalog hyphen SBR. Now let's start Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio. Okay. Now connect. Uh, go to the Object Explorer. Expand the database folder. And uh, my table na database name is my task DB. Expand the my task DB. Expand the table folder. Okay. My table name is student in founder score tab what I already created. Now select records. How many records are there in the student info tab? There are six records. ID, name, address, age, contact and date of birth. Now I'm gonna insert one more record. 7 Jan USA 35 and the date of birth. Okay. Now start visual studio. new project now i'm gonna create a new project to display how to change grid view row color on mouse over expand the visual basic select windows and name the uh, application windows form application change the row color mouse over e all tutorial folder okay now my application is created resize this form and uh, go to the toolbox and uh, add a label control yes this label control I will use as a title of this form okay now change the text of this label control text is row color on mouse over expand the font and change the font size is 16 font bold true and uh, color font color is white back color select form and uh, change the back color yes now it's looking nice now i'm gonna add a button control this button control i'll use to load the data in daily grid view this is the button control and uh, change the tab font size 12 font bold true and for color is button face oh uh, yes white and back color of this button is yes violet okay now change the text of this button load data and now I'm gonna add a data grid view control resize this data grid view go to the button click event yes in this click event I will write code to load uh, data from SQL Server database to data grid view using pp.net ok now dim con has new SQL can a connection To add SQL connection, you should add namespace import system.data.sql client. Okay, it's uh, added. Now go to the server explorer, data connection, right click, add connection, server name. My server name is catalog hyphen SBR. Okay, and uh, authentication is SQL server authentication. Username SA, password is SQL server authentication password. And the database name, my database name is my task DB. Select my task DB. Test connection succeeded. OK. Expand the expand it and see that uh, student info tab ID name. OK. Now right click on the database and uh, go to the property connection string, copy the connection string and paste it in uh, SQL connection. You can see. Now scroll command dim cmd as new scroll command. My scroll command is to select all the records from a student info tab. 
which will display in directed view so select star from student info underscore tab this is my table name student info underscore tab con now scroll date adapter so dim as the as new scroll date adapter cmd okay now date table dim dt as new data table finally sd dot fill dt okay now data git b1 dot data source equal to dt load data oh no additional login failed for user sls check the connection string I uh, go to the SQL uh, connection connection string yes you can see here uh, ID SA is okay but password is a star so put your password yes now it's okay debug again load data yes all the records displaying in the data grid view perfectly okay now I'm gonna show how to change grid view local on mouse over in that case select grid view go to the property click on event and uh, uh, click on cell mouse move double click on cell mouse move event yes the event is created data grid view under uh, one underscore cell mouse move so right code if e dot row index greater than minus one i mean if the record exists in the data grid view okay data grid view one dot rows e dot row index dot default cell style dot back color equal to color dot blue violet i mean uh, in mouse over it will change the back color is blue violet and the font color i mean for color for color will be color dot white okay let's debug test load data you can see uh, it's colored but uh, uh, to erase color on mouse leave right code on cell mouse leave event go to the property double click on cell mouse leave event yes this event is created As same you just uh, uh, change the color back color default is white so color uh, color is white and font color is black okay now te let's test yes you can see on a mouse leave it will back on previous condition okay okay it's working fine you have done uh, raw color on mouse over now I'm gonna show you can learn cell color on mouse over instead of uh, raw color I mean space pixel in which cell you just uh, move your cursor okay now data grid view one dot rows e dot row index dot cell the previous one uh, has a cell default cell style now the cell e dot column index dot style dot back color equal to color dot blue violet and uh, same as for color i mean font color style dot for color equal to for color equal to color dot white okay see that it's working and the same is uh, all right this code in on mouse leave event and this leave event back color will be white and for for, for color will be black okay now test load data yes it's working fine so you can understand the uh, and uh, you can uh, change uh, give you row color on mouse over or cell color on mouse over you can choose any color uh, like uh, color dot cornflower blue you can see now it's cornflower blue. 